what's happening? I'm like so high right now. They gave me a bunch of drugs okay. before they did this, and I'm You're tripping sick. balls. If I bleed tonight, if I am sad tonight, I don't. Summer Fellow Nights, here it is, or this will be the finale of Tomb Raider, definitely the finale of definitively edition of Tomb Raider Paladin here in Tomb Raider Edition. Welcome back to it. Look at this motherfucker, like this still shot is so fucking nice, just of her going, oh, what? And him going, I'm your enemy, come at me bro. And the explosive rounds really would have helped here. I'm just saying. I'm dumb. I went for the shotgun advances and said so that I should have looted more stuff. Just by even a little. Just by even if I would have looted a couple more bodies or a couple more something with salvage and I would have had that. But, you know, live and let learn. And then you get loves. So that's the thing. We'll go back. We're gonna resume. Oh yeah, this is gonna have to be a scramble attack, kinda. Yeah, because... What the hell? Where did he go? Maybe not. Don't like blow off specific parts of his armor? Am I supposed to do that? Bam 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 Okay, you got a weak spot on your back. That's hilarious and dumb. And you take my mighty axe! You really want to keep doing this? Fine. I will apply. Hip, hip, hip. Oh my god! He teleported! And it hurt really! Fucking bad! He one shot at me. He tossed me like a bitch and he ended my life. We gotta do something about that not happening again. I have to get a swing range of big boy right here, so. Hot who can. <laughs> oh my god! That went right across my face. <laughs> bam, 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 bam. Did he execute him? I didn't get you took my kill. Bing! Of course that killed me. Why would that have not definitely killed me? I'm gonna get rid of your fucking douchebags first. I whatever that was. At least I didn't die in one shot that time. <laughs> you just gotta keep spawning these assholes. Cause cool, give me more ammo I guess. If only they gave me cool out not does. Ah, you turn too fast you son of a bitch. Don't get close enough to grab me. What are you doing? Some of them more bitches. Stop some of them more bitches. Wow, I nailed him once. I winged him. I did absolutely fuck all there. Oh, come on. I do
Wow. Does that thing even know how to fucking- Where did it- This is the fucking worst. Those grenades are fuck all. Oops. <laughs> Back shot. Bitch. I was reloading and took my finger off the dodge. Took my finger off the controller for here. At least my left hand. And now you get done, son. Wow. Fuck your life. Not the time, motherfucker. Ow, in the back of my goddamn head. Ooh. I may have a lot of brain damage now. Am I actually hitting him? And I stand like I am the most amazing, wonderful thing in all of time. Hell yeah. I'm the shit, baby. Ooh. I got things. I see. Alright. There we go. Let's see what poppin', baby. Let's go in blazing, shotty blazing. I'm gonna scramble to it. Oh god, we're loading. <laughs> that would be funny if there was one last campfire outside this area. No! Don't you fucking dare. Okay. <laughs> fucking button prompts. Ow. This ends, in this ends now. Okay, I couldn't tell that was square at first. My eyes don't deceive me. Looks like I can shoot this bastard. Yeah, I got one down. You get done. You get done, double sudden. I didn't realize I was also supposed to be aiming at him. Manually and whatnot. But now I doubled up, baby. Nice. Wow, look at that swirling sky. That was beautiful. Hey, can you stop floating, my friend? That would be great. Stab it! You got fire to the chest is very effective. I'll tell Pokemon about that. A torch to the chest is very effective. Blazing torch to the chest, albeit. Sal. Dean. Oh, Sam. Dean. Oh, God. <laughs> Sorry about all the scratches. Laurel. What's happening? I'm like so high right now. They gave me a bunch of okay. drugs before they did this, and I'm You're tripping safe. balls. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Are you a gecko? Geckos always I made help. You a promise. <laughs> She's like, Let's get you home. Sure I am. Oh, with the fucking light. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here. Yay. Game end. Hell yeah, the storm's letting up, everything's gonna be like gravy. And not the baby gravy.
Yay! I succeeded. And now they make you do the trek back, <laughs> carrying her the entire way. She's got How? That's literally impossible to get back the way I fucking came she with did. somebody else that I would have to carry like that the entire time. Not fucking happening, bro. <laughs> but whatever. She's going to be okay. It's like, hey, let's fast travel you back. Don't worry about it, dude. What happened up there? Now your motherfucking business. It's over. We can go now. You can go All right. now. Let's get the hell out of here. Mm -hmm. I've been so blind, so naive. For years, I resented my father, doubted him like the rest. <laughs> Daft. He was right. He was doffed. So I could imagine I her saying that to her mom. Dad was so doffed. There are so many Maybe mysteries not. that I once dismissed. Daddy, you're so doffed. But the line between our myths and truth is fragile and blurry. I need to find answers. I must understand. Hell yeah. You need to be Tomb Raiding. And now this is the end of my Tomb Raiding experience for these ones. I have not played the other two. So, once this ends, and I start the new one, it's a whole new world. I didn't even really remember a lot of this game, but definitely that. Need anything? Mm. Don't really know what happened to you on that island. Judging from those wounds and that look in your eyes, I'm guessing I don't want to know. Anyway, we'll be home soon. Back to Croft Mana. I'm not going home. Bitch, I know how it's like Batman at the end. It's like my adventure is not done yet. Like, there's other shit to do. I go right from one to one. A survivor is born. But it's like, bitch, go home, clean up, refresh your body, take like a second of rest. And not on a goddamn boat. Hope you enjoyed playing Tomb Raider. We have worked our hardest to bring you the best game we could possibly make. Thank you for the time, taking the time to complete our game. No problem, man. It's fucking amazing and awesome and wonderful and cool, even though I didn't get the explosive bears at the end and I should shoot myself in the foot with a magnum. A 44 magnum, the most powerful hack I did all over the now. Cool. Look at the teams of people who made stuff. <laughs> oh boy. This was yay. We, we beat it. So now, nothing else is on the table. So you'll get three episodes. So this would be... What did I do? 31, 32, 33. I'm thinking this is 33? Episode 33 is the finale, and that's going to be amazing. Check out all these beautiful, wonderful, amazing peepees. They're the shine. Dig that sash, bro. It better be real. Nope, they're not. Totally not real. I want those mustaches to be real, damn it. Don't take my joy away from me. <laughs> Mike Oliver. Herman Falk. <laughs> What is that music, bro? Programming team. I don't want to take away from any of these people, so I will talk during the end of this. But overall, this first fucking, like, reboot or remake or reimagining, whatever, rebootage of the franchise in this definitive Tomb Raiding edition has been amazing. I liked it back then when I was playing it on the PS3, and I definitely liked PS4, but this this. It was so good to be able to play this all the way through for you guys. It took forever. You know how I am with series. I tend to come back to them later. Do short bursts of them and then come back. Maybe one off every once in a while and then it takes a while. Resident Evil anyway, took months for me to beat. A few months. It came out in May, right? So I beat it. It took me about a couple months. So this 
beaten this as well. Took a little while while being, but you got the full series now, guys. And there might even be, I don't want to tease you guys, but, you know, we might ever go back to there and go read some more tombs, see if there was anything I was missing, see if anything is worth getting. Those explosive arrows at the end. My god, all they would have to do is teleport back. That would make that a whole different ass situation if I had those explosive arrows. Ah, oh, damn. I would have poon. <laughs> Mike Poon, at your service. CFO. Yeah, you better be CFO, dude. Or else everybody's gonna look at you and be like, no, motherfucker. Trout! Babcock. Okay, I'm sorry, these are your names, but wasted. Oh my god, it's like the GTA reference, only longer. But I'm wasted. I, I, Cornelius. Man, that's ominous music now, and I don't like it. Overall, the combat in this is fantastic, especially if you're, you know, better at it than me, which is probably a lot of people. Are, are better at it than me. Tried to mix it up. I did some really amazing things in there, but I know that if I like was more professional at it, tried harder, did a lot more moves, mixed it up, did more shit than just fire, 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 fire. That combat can be amazingly fluid and fun to look at and fun to do. I didn't tend to do that a lot, but man, that was so awesome how it's set up and like all the upgrades especially for the shotgun i'm a shotgun goddamn fanatic so giving me the ability to upgrade my shotgun that much from giving it fire ammo to making the magazine bigger to just everything about that is awesome you know giving me fire for anything is just great fire arrows was amazing um given the explosive ones that would have been really cool too i do remember my play what I was doing by myself that ended up being cool but I didn't get to do it for you guys I'm sorry about that but the story is good it's a good establishing story however for my opinion it because I have little to no attention span sometimes so if you lock me into doing the same thing repeatedly over and over and over again you tend to lose my attention and irritate me so this it tended to irritate me a little because after a certain point it's just go back to the boat talk to them oh something new happened i had to leave go save it stop wait don't leave on the boat the storms are fucked up there's a whole bunch of shit you don't understand just stay here i know you're pissed off bye evil guy betrays him and then that that process repeated without the evil guy it was just like that repeated like three to four different times where i just had to convince these people not to fucking do shit and then the four times they were eventually like well i guess maybe yes kind of and i'm like why do i have to keep going back to that narrative well like seeing that over and over again that people were pissed off after i would go and do something and explain something and that guy ah! That was stupidly frustrating. <sighs> we just did that a lot in that whole game, just going back to them, something went wrong. Uh, don't leave the island. So yeah, that lost my interest real quick. But the combat was what held it together for there. Like the salvaging and stuff like that made it pretty damn cool. Like. Killing animals lost its interest, and they tended to piss me off a lot by getting away and stuff like that. But it was it was cool to fight the wolves and shit. I understand their survival aspect of it. That was really nice, but it got cast away definitely, like in the later part of the game. Because you didn't just need it anymore. By then, you should have enough shit that you don't need to be shooting random pigs to take like 10 experience and a handful of freaking salvage if you have that ability equipped. Um, so that became another pointless part of the game because it didn't stay relevant the entire time. A lot of shit about this game became more relevant once again when you got new abilities and stuff. You need to calm the fuck down with your music. God damn. Poppy. I thought this said hairy ankle. I legit thought it said hairy ankle. 
Um, Dick Lever. You are not telling me there's some dude named Dick Lever. And if it's not pronounced like that, I don't care. But Dick Lever is the shit now. He's my favorite. <laughs> but repetitiveness about this game, shit that felt like it became completely pointless at a certain point. So it didn't come back or it just came back in smaller bursts or it just was there and you're like, meh. That tended to keep happening. But what frustrated me was my lack of goodness sometimes. <laughs> oh my god, making a bad situation worse. But like I said, narratively, it is what it is. Went through the paces, evil god, schemy news reporter guy that would do anything for a story. Got cut in here. In fact, I uh, kept saving everybody and their fucking mother was annoying. Uh, it was good. I still really enjoyed it for what it was. If I take all the gripes away and just look at the story from boop bape and bap, I like the boop bape and bap. But the boop ape, it did 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 the boop ape, and then the bap. That's a little boop ape and bap. <laughs> but thank you guys, like, combat, best part about this game, hands down, the upgrade system is rough fucking mendes. Not only with the, um, attacks, like, your survival skills, but then upgrading your freaking weapons as well. So fun. Always has been. Always will be. Just one of the greatest joys about that. If you play this game just to raid the tombs for exploration and puzzle solving in your brain and then do, like, love the upgrade, that's all you need. Like, ignore the fucking... <laughs> wow, that's a lot of crop stuff. God damn! Um, but if you enjoyed just that part, this is the perfect game for you. So, there's a lot of shit here. Look at all these wars and tombs and raiding and wars and tombs and raiding. Tomb Raider girl. That daddy is family. Family. News channel. Passion. Holy fucking crap. There is just a stupid amount of cross love. World of Tomb Raider. Dedicated team on the official Tomb Raider forums. No, I see. Chip Henson. That feels very familiar. Lastly, to a credible community of passionate artists, Arthurs, bloggers, players, and super fans who tenaciously supported Laura since 1996. Survivors were born. Conrad, Conway, Gallagher's. Man, that's a lot of passion. Abby Strauss, thank you, Madison Hall, and Makina Strauss, loving memory, Debbie. Did you try shooting the window? We love it, Dan Tushin. First here. Aww. Oh, so precious. 2013. What the hell was that, son, Jolt? You could let me look at the rest of it, you fuck. I'm not doing that voice control shit, ever. Complete the story with an overall game completion of 76. So I had like... 24? Wow, that's a lot of shit. Turn to the item by selecting continue in order to complete any unfinished activities. I'm sure I will probably not. But thank you all so much for watching this series. It has been tremendous and wonderful and amazing and awesome and I can't thank you so much for watching. Oh my gosh, oh my god. Leave a like on this video if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment below about what was your favorite part of this series. Or even what is your favorite Tomb Raider. Let's leave it at that. You can leave two messages. Go ahead leave them in the comments below. Name your favorite Tomb Raider. Give a short description why. And name your favorite part of this series. And why. That's your homework assignment. Wait, you don't like homework? Wait, you're leaving because you don't like homework? Wait, you're mad at me because I gave you homework? Okay, it's not homework. It's a fun activity to do on your own and then put it in the comments below and it's a fun activity. It's a joy, it's a party, it's a happy-go-lucky fun time. I got it. Share this video around so people know I do shit like this. 
epic music share this video around so they know about the epic music subscribe to the channel today to become part of the twisted nights table ring that notification bell and set all so you know whenever the hell i post oh some hilarious highlights are always there to make you laugh now that this two rare edition is done i should make hilarious highlights out of it eventually before i run out of space to my fucking playstation all right i'll be over this never ever forget that you may get hilarious highlights of this sometime in the future who knows at this point my brain is broken most of the time Ugh. <laughs> i love you guys never ever forget that and i will see you fellow knights in the later time bye guys woohoo definitely beat that edition of tomb raider bye